Hello friends, this is Femi from your very own channel Femi How. In this video tutorial, you are going to learn how to calculate overtime and wages according to that overtime. Here you can see that I have created a worksheet in whose heading is overtime calculation for employees. Here I have taken 8 as regular hours and rate per hour is $10. Then you can see that I have different headings, serial number, name, arrival, <laughs> arrival time, departure time, total hours, overtime and daily wages according to that overtime. Here you can see that there are different arrival times and departure times. First of all, I will calculate the total hours. So how will I calculate the total hours? I will start a formula by typing equal. Then I will start a bracket. After that, I will click on the column which contains the departure time then I will type minus and then the arrival time I will close the bracket then press enter and you can see that I have got 8 hours the first person Steve has served for 8 hours and 8 hours is a regular time so he did not performed over time now if I stretch it down you can see that I have got the working hours of the other employees too it's very simple. For calculating overtime, we will start formula with equal. Then click on the column of total hours. Then press minus. Then start a bracket. Type minimum M I N M. Then start a bracket. After that, type 8 because 8 is the normal regular hours of work then type comma after that again type total hours close the red bracket and you can see that i have opened a black bracket again close the second bracket and press enter you can see that the first person has got no overtime so bring the cursor to the corner of the cell so that its sign changes to plus then drag it down this formula will be applied to the other cells but here you can see that I have got a problem. Here you can see that a person which has worked for 10, 10 hours has got zero overtime. So I will need to fix a little thing. The thing is that press dollar type dollar dollar sign before and after the G. And now press enter and now drag it down. So you can see that the problem has been solved. Now let's calculate.